October has uncovered a series of notable cyber activities across different industries. Join us as we explore the key cyber events of October 2023. This is SIP Cyber Monthly Roundup, brought to you by OpsWAT, a global leader in IT and OT cybersecurity. Let's kick off this month's update with the Israel-Hamas cyber impact. Amid the Israel-Hamas conflict, cyber warfare has taken a front seat, with multiple hacker groups launching targeted attacks on critical assets. Anon Ghost, for instance, manipulated an app used by Israelis for rocket strike warnings, disseminating fake alerts. Another unidentified group aimed at public-facing sites in Israel, notably those of financial institutions and utilities. These actions not only disrupt daily operations but also expose the vulnerabilities inherent in critical infrastructure. The majority of these cyber attacks have manifested as DDoS campaigns. Their strategic focus on essential services and systems emphasizes the evolving challenges and heightened stakes of infrastructure security in today's geopolitical landscape. Beyond the Israel-Hamas cyber conflict, pro-Iranian hacktivists target Israeli control systems. The hacktivist group Sieged Sec has been spotlighted for its alleged cyber activities against Israeli industrial control systems. Recent findings unveiled a list from Sieged Sec, claiming these as their Israeli ICS targets. Found via dark web analyzes, the list includes IP addresses marked for attacks on Israeli infrastructure. Sieged Sec, in collaboration with the pro-Iranian group Anonymous Sudan, aims at systems like satellite receivers and Modbus ICS. However, evidence indicates that these attacks might not have been fully executed. This list could potentially rally other cyber attackers, highlighting the growing threats to critical infrastructure. Turning our attention stateside, manufacturing sectors are not immune to cyber threats. A significant U.S. manufacturer of building materials, Simpson Manufacturing Company, recently reported a disruptive cyber attack affecting its business operations. The company informed the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission SEC, of the incident, noting that they experienced IT infrastructure disruptions after detecting malicious activity. As a precaution, they promptly took their systems offline. Simpson Manufacturing, a provider of essential construction and retrofitting products, has over 3,000 employees and reported nearly $600 million in net sales last quarter. This incident is the latest in a series of attacks on major manufacturers, emphasizing the growing cyber threat to industries essential to the nation's critical infrastructure and economy. On the regulatory front, U.S. agencies are stepping up their game in the face of evolving cyber threats. The FBI, in collaboration with the CISA, has issued a joint cybersecurity advisory concerning the AVO's Locker ransomware variant. This advisory comes after recent investigations identified AVO's Locker targeting U.S. critical infrastructure organizations spanning various sectors, including government, financial services, and critical manufacturing. The ransomware as a service ROS, operation has been on the radar for over a year, with its track record of successful attacks prompting this government advisory. The latest advisory provides updated indicators of compromise, IOCs, tactics, techniques, and procedures TTPs, and introduces detection methods. Experts emphasize the evolving nature of threats like AVO's locker, especially as infrastructure becomes increasingly interconnected, expanding the potential attack surface for cybercriminals. Wrapping up our October insights, this month's events highlight the paramount importance of robust security measures. Thank you for tuning in to our Cyber News Roundup. Remain vigilant, stay informed, and join us next month for further updates on critical infrastructure cybersecurity.